Hi everyone, Shotlight here. I'm recording this one a bit earlier than usual, since I'll be most likely taking my time off during the holidays, just like everyone else. Anyways, I thought I'd pop out a video you can watch before returning to that comfy couch and going for the annual watch of Die Hard or Endless Waltz. Without further ado, let us commence! When thinking of mechs associated with winter, a lot of people would likely bring up the GM Call Districts type or one of the various machines from Gundam's two major OVAs, the War in the Pocket and the Gundam Wing the Endless Waltz. Though while those picks aren't without merit, the subject of this video is the Drag Cold Climate type from After War Gundam X, because these snowboarding boys are the getting a laugh love. I'll be going over their SD Gundam G Generation overworld appearance, as this is one of the few games where you get to play with one. They're somewhat easy to obtain early on. They're quite solid when it comes to stats, considering that they're above average for a grunt unit within their price range. When it comes to movement, the drag has the move range of 5, but the land capability is 8 tier and it sports a respectable C tier capability underwater. If you want to get one, they evolve from Janice and Enel's custom Janice Kai at level 3, or from Septum, Septum Kai, Birdigo, or Petulia at level 2. So, basically the fastest way to get it is to either buy the Janice from the 30,000 points you get at the start, play the first level, and let the mobile suit hog most of the kills. Alternatively, you can get them to production list early by purchasing a Dotrus and combining it with the Tornado Gundam in the design tab. Once they're on the production list, you can also buy them at the price of 14,800 points apiece. Another, more cost-effective way is to trigger the first break at the stage 3A by destroying 10 Death Army units within 3 turns, getting the land ships to spawn and then killing the left one as soon as the units inside it are deployed. Capture them, destroy the other units, and preferably finish off the Master Gundam without using the Mon Cassius machine. You'll get 3 Genese units that you can later turn into the aforementioned snowboard robots. They're fun to use and can be turned into stronger units like the Vertigo, meaning you can get a lot of use from these guys. Well, that does it for the brief holiday entry, Godspeed and Merry Christmas! Shirtlaid, signing out!